Okay, so let's get started. I decided just to record a few things from my workouts the past two days just to give you guys some content. I don't like to do these videos too much just because when I don't have anyone to record for me, they can be kind of boring to just have the camera in one place. But yeah, whatever. Here we go. So here I'm just doing some leg extensions. I go really light to warm up. I looked over that thing because this machine was definitely messed up on the way down. It was, I don't know, it was really weird. But yeah, as you can see, I just hold it at the top and try to go pretty slow down. And that's how I warm up my quads for leg day. Here's a little side shot because I wanted to show you guys that I have some muscle. Yeah. And you can see the little like, I don't know, are those fibers? Like fibers kind of like being jittery around. So I feel like, you know, that's doing some good stuff in there. Fibery, jittery fibers. Yeah. So here we're just gonna go over to the bar. This is the only kind of bar that I like. And just squat some. I have my belt on. I love that belt because it says brick house on the back so everybody can know what the deal is. But yeah, here I just do this. I got 25s on each side to warm up. I never go heavy on squat, guys. Everyone's like, how much do you squat? Uh, not shit. I just don't squat heavy. And that's that. Because it hurts my knees and my back and everything. So, yeah. All right, warm up set over with. Now I add on another 25, and this is just a different shot for all you pervs out there. Yep, this is that the shot, the pervy shot. But the thing that I like about this one actually is because I can see my hamstrings working on the back of my legs. That's always been a part that I've been trying to build up. So I like seeing that work and at the top just a squeeze and squeeze and squeeze every time guys you gotta squeeze that booty at the top and that's what I'm doing there. I don't really have anything else to say about this. So yeah here I am squatting. Wow, that was a really long squeeze there. I was really going for the squeeze. Oh, and we're done. We're done with that. Now we have a leg press machine. I like to keep my hands in between uh, like that. I, I don't know if you notice, but basically it just helps me not feel like I'm being crushed at the very bottom. If you call that cheating, oh well, because I like the way I look, and so I'm gonna keep doing my workouts the way that I want to do them so there's that but yeah I just do a little leg press I always you don't see all the different ones I do here but I change up the width of my feet and the height of my feet the more like high you have your feet on that machine it will work sort of the back of your legs more and then the lower you have it it will work um, kind of the top so right here I have it a little bit high but kind of just towards the middle to try to work a little bit of everything and to finish off i do these lunges in the smith machine i like doing it in the smith machine because it helps lunges it's like balance wise it's really hard to have a lot of control at least for me so in the smith machine it helps just the balance so you're not worrying about having to do all that you can just focus on the lunges and I try to keep kind of like a bend in my knee the whole time, if that makes any sense. If you can see, I never really like walk out. And that was some of the stuff from my leg day. Now we're on back day, big back baby, big back bed. Yep, all right. So at the top, if you can see, I like to let, I let it all the way loose and I just get a good stretch at the top, like there, there. I stretch it all the way at the top because this is how I start my back day. I do two back days a week. And yeah, I just like starting it like this. It gets me a nice stretch. I do it heavy and then I lower the weight in half. 
and I'd go nice and slow. Nice and slow. But this is just to feel like I'm like activating all the muscles. Nothing like activating your muscles when you're working out. Yeah. I think a lady's getting ready to walk in front of the camera because I remember seeing her in the mirror and she's like, whoops. But maybe I'm wrong. I do about 10 of these or so. I don't know. I, d I don't really keep count sometimes. I just kind of do it until I feel like, oh, there she is. Cool converses, red converses, yeah. Should be finishing up here soon. I hope, because I have nothing more to say about this. Oh, yeah, it's coming. All right, then we're gonna go over to this. I don't, I don't even know what this is called. I don't know the back, the back thing. All right, so I do the back thing. I just try to use my back muscles on the back thing. And that's, that's that really, yep, that's it. All right. These are some of my favorites, guys. A lot of people don't do these and they really should because it works. Everyone wants to know how you get some, want to look like a trophy. Get some lats on you right here, baby. Some dumbbell pullovers. You can literally see my lats working. And yeah. These are great for your lats. And then I go straight from these to dumbbell rows. And I like to do the dumbbell rows how you're about to see because it takes a lot of pressure like off of my lower back from pulling and stuff like that. I don't know if that makes any sense. But yeah. So I'm not, because I like to get a nice stretch at the bottom and then when I pull up, like this helps me to not throw my back out and just focus it and then on back days I also do biceps and then this is me just trying to see how heavy I can go like an asshole so I got the 45 pound dumbbells to do hammer curls and I don't everyone a hammer curl is different than like a regular bicep curl so yes they're supposed to be this way so shut up I don't know how many I did I think I did like five or something and then I go straight from that to I go over and then I cut the weight basically in half and I so they don't have like 22.5s or whatever I don't know it's half I just went to 20s and with these a little bit I turn in a little bit on the top just to get all of all of the bicep and yeah guys that's that